We're here at the Black Cultural Archives in Kennington, South London. A session is taking place, bringing together a group from a local school, Dunraven, with speakers from the archives, author Alex Wheatle, journalist Simeon Brown, and amateur filmmaker Clovis Salmon. Has Britain changed since the era captured in these collections? If so, what has changed and why has it changed? No, if not, why not? We're going to put change on trial. Using the heritage resources available here at the BCA, we're trying to understand some of the context behind the Brixton riots of 1981. They just don't get on. And so therefore it was almost impossible to get those in authority to accept that race existed as a problem. William Whitelaw, he was the Home, the home Secretary, and um, that's when the chant came up. On, on archive film, there's, there's, there's this young black girl and she's frying a mat of expletives at him. But um, apart from that, there was a chant that went up, White Law, White Law. I always have my camera in my in my pocket. The police and the youth fighting in Brixton. Did you have your camera ready? So I said, if I take my camera like this, someone is going to take it away and knock it out. Everyone has worked to bring this particular aspect of local history to life. <laughs> 